Uh, I can't wait for this fight. Um, I've been training for this pro debut for six months. Very excited about these elbows and knees that I can use to the head now. I've been cutting weight hard, you know, I'm angry from cutting weight and I kind of put all that on my opponent, you know, it's, he's the reason why I've been training so hard and it's all going to unfold Saturday night. After Mark, Mark's got, he's got to crack my back and stuff today because I'm a little tight. Just, he warmed up to get his sweat and then we'll get out there and start going around. Okay. With this fight coming up, I get, you know, so more uh, anxious to get in there because I've been training with, you know, my guys so long and I can finally get out there and, you know, start hitting someone else that, that I don't like and I'm really excited for it. Joe Highland is almost, and I don't want to say like a copy of me, but he's a, a younger, better version of what I do. I, I do like to coach him. We have very similar styles, very similar attitudes. We, we are very, very similar, but he's bigger, stronger, faster. He's the new and improved model of what I do. I was ready for this fight four months ago. I've just been getting better and better and better every single day, and the anticipation for this fight, it's, it's killing me. I, I can't wait to get out there. And you know, finally, my time's come, and I'm ready. Back, you know, knotted up a little bit this morning. Uh, sometimes I'll get those spasms where it just kind of knots up in the back. So I got a good coach, you know, he's got a bunch of sweet techniques where uh, he cracks the shit out of you. Loosens you up, limbers you up, gets you ready to fight. So uh, he's a uh, healing hands as well as a great coach, so it's great to have him. You know what you'll get? Put your hands on the ground. Let's just stretch out. There you go. Big breath through your stomach. Joe Highland is definitely uh, the most insane guy here. Uh, as I have stated before, this guy never knows when to back up. You know, you hope that guys can uh, get tired from going crazy, but this guy doesn't get tired. Uh, like I said, one word would be crazy, wild, maybe insane. You know, that, that's all Joe. The tough guys, I guess, to fight sometimes is the guys that are wild because you don't know where the punch is coming from. You don't know what to expect from them, you know? Every time you hurt him, he goes wild, which is the scariest. At least for me, it's the scariest because then the punches come all over the place and next thing you know, you're either down or you're just struggling to survive. He always had conditioning and quickness and speed. But now, with putting his hands together with his wrestling and it, giving him confidence that he can stand and bang with anyone, it just makes the rest of his game that much tougher. Cause 